What's up guys, this is Kairos and um, I happily, I, I'm happy because I got the Archangel from the Comic Con. It's a really freaking awesome um, figure. It's a Marvel Legends figure, six inch figure. And um, there was a mechanical problem with it. The wings were really loose and floppy, so you couldn't really pose the figure. And I've noticed that a lot of people have the same problem. So uh, I tried modifying it to see if maybe I could make the wings stronger. As you, as you can see here in the video, I'm using um, some tools to pull out the plug like right now. Um, but you know, you can use like the back of a paintbrush, like those wooden paintbrushes to push the plug out. Like you see right there, that plug. And uh, you won't chip any paint. You have to be really careful and you do have to put a lot of pressure. Uh, you see that little nut there? That's what holds the plug in in the uh, wing. The, you have to uh, lost that thing like two times because it flew out in the air. Um, you need crazy glue and a little wire and a little uh, alligator clip. You could get these at um, Amazon.com. They're called the Helping Hands magnifying glass and they're really cheap, they're $5. So this has the same uh, diameter as the, um, the little nut. So that's the only thing I could find that I can use to push in the nut once I'm, I was finished without scratching um, the paint because I, I really didn't want to mess up the wing. So uh, I put a dab of glue with the wire inside the, um, the joint right here, as you can see. And you, just to put, you have to put just a little bit on the wire and go around the inside of the joint and let it dry for a while. So uh, this takes like about five or 10 minutes. And um, once it's dry, I recommend you do it one more time because the first time I did it wasn't enough. Um, once you do this, um, you can put the plug back inside. Uh, yeah, remember to close my crazy glue. This is, this is like the third time I'm doing the audio because uh, I had the fan on and the fan ruined the whole audio that was live. So I'm doing this a different way, which I'm not used to. But right now the joint is dry, the glue is dry. I'm pushing in the joint. I recommend you use a piece of a cloth so you won't scratch the, the chrome on the wings. Um, if you find it that it's really tight, which is good, uh, you can use like a little something to, you know, kind of scrape the inside, like maybe a, what, like those little file, file, hobby files. They're like, you know, you can use that. I use just a little sharp tool, like a X-Acto knife and just kind of scraped a little bit. I'm here, I'm pushing in with the, um, with the, um, that piece of brush that I use. Now I was really scared that I was gonna ruin the, the chrome, but um, I was I guess I was lucky or you know, but um, it was really bothering me that the wings were you know loose. So um, here's the this is the final part where you put the little nut, and as you can see, you have to put that side, not this side. It's the one see, and these little things just fly all over the place. Like two or three times, I lost it. It was kind of crazy looking for it. But finally, I got it in place. You can shove it in with your with your finger, and um, use the alligator clip to push it in. Now it's really tricky because you don't want to scratch the paint, and you got to put a lot of pressure. So it is kind of dangerous. So I don't really recommend this if you're not like used to doing mods. But um, I thought I should just share it because it's a great figure, and the results were were kind of great. So they weren't perfect but the results are great so the wings are now posable so this is the alligator clip uh, I'm using to push in the um, the little nut in place so it can hold the plug now it wasn't easy I, I'll be honest it wasn't easy but if you use the cloth and you have a steady hand um, it's possible I put some tape around the um, alligator clip so I wouldn't like cut my my skin because it's a sharp um, object um, so here you're just going to watch me <laughs> kind of suffer a little trying to get the nut in place. Um, but the wing is nice and tight, so bear with me. Um, at the end you will, you will see this. Like I said, this is like the first, first time I'm doing the audio because, uh, 
uh, separately because uh, I had the fan on and the fan was hitting the camera and it was the you can it, it just ruined the whole audio the the, the wind from the fan uh, so the mic caught all this wind and it just ruined the whole audio so also so right here look I'm pushing in I'm trying to push push it in place you have to be careful because these little things pop and fly really far away so be careful um, and I recommend you use the any uh, like a soft cloth like a t-shirt I'll hit here finally I did it I snapped it in and they're both in place and you can see um, the wings do hold the pose I should have showed you how floppy it was before but before it couldn't hold at all this 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 pose it would just flap down and fall the wings would just fall down like it was really loose I don't know if most people had this problem but I know a lot of people have the problem um, that they're kind of loose but mine were just extremely loose they were just like they wouldn't work at all now this, this part right here where I'm touching I couldn't do anything there because uh, the joint there is a different mechanical joint design so I couldn't do the fix that I did like at the base here but um it's good enough I think to hold the, the pose um, I think you I shake it here or a little bit in a ahead in a video but um yeah I couldn't do any kind of those poses right now that I'm doing with the figure without the wings just falling and collapsing on, onto its weight so I'm pretty happy with the results and I hope that maybe somebody um, fixes their um, angel wings wings because um, it was pretty frustrating you know um, it's a great figure like I said I'm really happy that I got it especially with the Wolverine and uh, Psylocke but um, I'm gonna do a review on the figures later on and um, yeah just want to share this uh, fix um, it, like I said it's just a great figure um, Yeah, so if you guys have any questions on Kyrus, uh, you know, like I said, if, if you don't, uh, if you're not like used to doing a, a little bit of modifications to your figures, I, I don't recommend it. But if you if you do mods, then yeah, I kind of recommend it. You do something like this, or maybe there's someone else that did something better that works better. But <clears throat> this is what I was able to come up with. It wasn't any damaging to the wing at all. I didn't chip any paint. I didn't ruin the joints or or nothing. I just added a little bit of uh, crazy glue, and um, now he can hold he can hold the pose, which is pretty cool. So yeah, looking forward to uh, a lot of the Marvel Legends coming up. The 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 next waves, uh, you know. Um, looking forward to the Captain America Ultimates. Uh, I still have to get the future Foundation, Foundation Spider-Man. Um, a bunch of figures, actually. Um, so, pretty cool that Marvel Legends are back. And i um, pretty happy that I got this figure. Archangel's been one of my favorite characters um, for a long time, since I was a kid. Um, and um, there's that broken piece of wood that I use. I mean, I just used an old brush and uh, it worked perfectly for this so yeah guys uh, you guys have any questions let me know this is Kairos and uh, I'll just <laughs> go away now and um, peace